think when you're an artist, you're kind of ever changing and you're always evolving. And so, like, we've evolved from basically being like a four-piece rock band to be to doing something that uh, I think is very cool. I think everybody is really settled in and everybody's like really on board with the new direction of the record. And so. Um, you know, even seeing myself play two years ago, I think, uh, you know, stylistically we've changed and musically we've changed and we've just kind of evolved as a band to this, to this place that we love, so. Crash and Burn is probably the hardest song I've sang on a record and for sure it's the hardest song I sing in our live show. It's like the highest of my register and the lowest of my register all within like 30 seconds. I did a lot of falsetto stuff on this record and I didn't even have a falsetto voice a year ago. I think just overall my voice has gotten stronger and, and uh, just did a lot of things vocally on this record that I probably wouldn't have been able to do on the last one. You know, writing with Dad in the beginning was, was me basically being a kindergarten student and writing with him now, we're kind of on, the, on that same page. Uh, my dad is sort of a chameleon of a songwriter. He can be in any room with any person of any genre and adapt to what they want to write. And I think that's what makes any songwriter great is when they can adapt to the room and adapt to a situation. Dad is always about the best song winning on my record, whether it's one that he wrote or, or whether it's, or it's one that he did not write. So he really does have my best interest at heart. And uh, it's just been so fun to be able to work with him and, and, and write songs with him for this album. I'm 25 years old, I grew up listening to all kind of different music and I can't sit down and just write one kind of song. Um, and so this record was completely free and everything I did on this record was something that I wanted to do and I really tried to develop it for my live show so the record is basically a set list. I want you to be able to listen to the whole thing without getting bored and I think that's how I want our live show to be too. Well,